So to solve the given differential equation, first, let's say write it in the form dy dx equals to f of x, y over g of x, y. And then if the degree of f of x, y and g of x, y are the same, and both are, homogen uh, both are homogeneous functions, then we'll make use of the substitution v, uh, y equals to vx. So here we have two x y plus x squared dy dx. That the meaning of y prime is three y squared plus two x y. And then this implies dy dx is given by 3y squared plus 2xy and then over 2xy plus x squared. Now the degree of this term is 2, degree of this term is 2, degree of this term is 2, and this is also 2. So it means the degree of the numerator is 2, degree of the denominator is 2. So this is homogeneous. Now, when the differential equation is homogeneous, we make use of the substitution y equals to vx, from which if you differentiate with respect to x on both sides, so we'll have dy dx. Now by product rule, Derivative of this is dv dx times this will get x dv dx plus if you differentiate this, you get one times b, you get b. So this is going to give us v plus x dv dx. equals to, now where this y you put vx, we'll have three vx squared plus two x vx divided by two x vx plus x squared. So we have changed our differential equation in terms of the variable x and v only. So this will be v plus x dv dx equals to 3x squared v squared plus 2x squared v over 2x squared v plus x squared. Now, this is v plus x dv dx equals to common is x squared into 3v squared plus 2v over x squared into 2v plus 1. So x squared and x squared cancels out. So we have v plus x dv dx equals to 3v squared plus 2v over 2v plus 1. Now, take this v to the right hand side. So we have x dv dx equals to 3v squared plus 2v <coughs> over 2v plus 1 minus v. Now, put all these terms over the same LCM, 2v minus 2v plus 1. So 3v squared plus 2v 
minus V into two V plus one. This will give us X dV dx equals to three V squared plus two V minus two V squared minus V over two V plus one. Now that will end up giving us three V squared minus two V squared is V squared, two V minus V is V over two V plus one equals to X dV dx. Now multiply both sides by X dx, we get X dV equals to V squared plus V over two V plus one dx. So we are trying now to separate variables. So next multiply by reciprocal of the right hand side coefficient of dx, we'll get two V plus one over V squared plus V dV and then divide through by X, we have dX over X. So next integrate both sides. So two V plus one over V squared plus V dV equals to the integral of dx over x. Now for left hand side, let u to be v squared, which means du equals to 2v dv. Okay, v squared plus v. So this be plus one, then dv. So letting all this to be U So now with that So letting this one to be V squared plus V, which implies du is two V plus one dV. So which means dV alone would be du over two V plus one. So this integral would be integral of two V plus one over U times du over two V plus one and this and this kinds of such. So it'll be the integral of the u over u, which is ln of u, uh, which means we'll have ln of v squared plus v. So then that would be the left hand side, ln of v squared plus v. Right hand side would be ln of x. And then plus, say a constant of integration, which you can write it as ln of c. So ln of v squared plus v, this is the same as ln of c x, loss of logarithms. So 
So which implies v squared plus v is cx. But remember v, x is the same as y. So which means v alone is y over x. So therefore, this will be y over x squared plus y over x equals to cx. So y squared over x squared plus y over x equals to cx. And then you can multiply through by x squared so that we have y squared plus xy equals to c x power p. So this would be a solution to that given equation. And then number two, another example of homogeneous differential equation will be given by sol x y squared dy x cubed plus y cubed dx. Now, since if you check uh, this has degree three, so one plus two is three, this one has three and this one has degree three. So uh, dy dx is the same as x cubed plus y cubed over x y squared. This is homogeneous. Because degree of the denominator is the same as degree of each of the term in the numerator. So being homogeneous, it implies that we let y to be vx. So which means dy dx is the same as x dv dx plus v. So we replace x dv dx plus v equals to x cubed. Now we are replacing these values into this dependent equation plus vx cubed over x vx squared. So we have x dv dx plus v is x cubed plus x cubed v cubed over x cubed v squared. So which can be written as x cubed into one plus v cubed over x cubed v squared. And should be seen that this this cancels out. So we have x dv dx plus v equals to one plus v cubed over v squared. So taking this to the right, we'll have x dv dx equals to one plus v cubed over v squared minus v put over the same LCM, so I have v squared one plus v cubed minus v cubed. So we get x dv dx is nothing but one over v squared because at this time and this time comes this out. So multiply through by dx, so x dv equals to one over v squared dx. And then multiply through by v squared, so v squared dv and divide through by x, dx over x. But then integrate. So integrating we have 
v squared dv equals to dx over x. This will be v cubed over three equals to ln of x, say plus c. Multiply it through by three. So you have v cubed equals to three ln of x plus three, let me call this one c1, three c1. And I can say three c1 to the c, so that I have v cubed equals to ln of x power three, loss of, uh, loss of logarithms plus c. But v is vx equals to y implies v is y over x. So therefore we have y over x cubed equals to ln of x cubed plus c. So that we have um, y cubed over x cubed equals to ln of x cubed plus c. And you can write this one as y cubed equals to x cubed ln of x cubed plus c x cubed. Or you can say y equals to x cubed ln of x cubed plus c x cubed base power a third. <laughs> 